guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here go ahead and press that subscribe button for me um i'm actually at a really cool and interesting location today as some say it's haunted and it has all kinds of layers of history it is the stonewall jackson training school for boys in concord north carolina now this school or these training grounds they use those terms legally to cover up abuse and neglect it I don't know how much I'm going to be able to shoot or do because there's no trespassing signs everywhere and there's a truck behind that bush who's watching the property. So I'm going to be as careful as I can while getting what I can. I'm probably just going to walk around or drive around and show you some of the buildings. But there's layers of history, layers of abuse, and there's even supposed bodies buried on the property so um let's see i don't know how i'm gonna do this just yet let's um i'm gonna pull up a bit and walk around and we'll go from there the last time i was here to get pictures uh you can do these pictures on my instagram if you're not following me there go ahead and follow me there but the last time i was here I saw people walking around using it for exercise, walking their pets, just generally enjoying the good weather we had last year. I'm thinking you can walk around and check out the property from the outside. Now I don't want to cause too much trouble because I can't risk my channel like that, but or my reputation because I try to obey by I try to obey certain laws. However, if you know of anybody who could get me in here, I would really appreciate it because I'm one of those people who appreciates history along with the aspect of paranormal. Let's um, get outside and walk around. The truck that I saw coming in that was parked is gone. So maybe they're just kind of hanging out and enjoying the nice weather we have because it's March, it's beautiful, the weather is finally warming up. Everybody wants to get out. My truck's gone. So. As usual, if you guys see or hear anything, let me know. Drop it in the comments. The wind is pretty gnarly today, by the way. Oh, hang on. I have to move my car. Maybe it's not as blocked off as I thought because that was a whole ass UPS truck. So. We're gonna drive a little further down to see what we can get. Hey, and there's somebody else just kind of bombing around. So, all right, I think it's good. I think it's safe enough to come out here and look around, but we're gonna drive up the side of the fences and see what else we can get. There's all kinds of potholes in the road. So if you do come here, just be a little weary of that. Don't risk your car if you can't make it. This property is really large and extends to some of these buildings over here and if you take down the road and make a right hand turn it goes back to even more buildings. But I'm going to go check out this really cool um, gazebo real quickly. All this graffiti. But if you cross into the gazebo, you can see outwards to the other buildings. That is a fire station, in case you didn't know.
If anybody has any more information or knows what some of these buildings were used for, I have a generalized good idea. But uh, if you guys have any comments or any more information, please feel free to drop it down below. If you drive all the way down, be careful because it's the more modern juvenile detention facility. And there's also a no flying drone sign in this area. Um, probably because they use this building for government purposes. I completely missed a few buildings. This area is larger than it looks, and there's a building off to the side called Swink Benzing Trade School. I'm pretty sure it's part of Stonewall Jackson School, but let me go check it out real quick. Holy crap. This is like on the far side. That's the main building I first showed coming in. Part of what they did here was they taught trades to kids who were deemed teachable. And I use deemed loosely because I imagine that term got tossed around quite a bit with these kids. Alright guys, I am headed back home. I am about an hour from where I live, so it's not too bad of a drive. So, you guys know what to do. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Leave any comments, feedback. I'm, I, I'm totally here for it. And I will see you guys in the next adventure. Peace out.